Hi, I'm Darshna from Twinkle. Today, we're going to dive into the world behind science and take a look at some of our scientists and inventors' resources. Each of our lessons takes a look at a different scientist or inventor and their contribution to the world of science. So let's take a look. Some of the many scientists and inventors included within our packs are Sir Joseph Banks, who introduced 80 species of plants, including the eucalyptus and the banksia, which is named after him. Marie Curie developed the use of x-rays, which meant that a lot more patients could be correctly diagnosed and treated. William Smith, who studied geology and would study the pattern of fossils, realised that he could tell the age of a rock by looking at fossils. And Inge Lehmann, who was a seismologist and looked at the waves of energy caused by earthquakes. She concluded that the Earth has a solid core at the centre. To find out more, simply type in scientists and inventors in the Twinkle search bar and you will see packs suitable for every year group. Click download now to download a zip file containing everything you will need to teach the unit. The handy planning overview provides a basic outline of lessons, resources and learning intentions. Of course, each lesson comes with a lesson plan, going into more detail on what is needed to prepare in advance for the lesson and a learning sequence of what will be taught. Each lesson itself also has a PowerPoint presentation, which guides you through the lesson. Each presentation begins by looking at who the particular scientist or inventor for the particular lesson is and what they are best known for. Any activities mentioned in the presentation are all included within the pack, saving you plenty of time. For example, children will enjoy playing this bone bingo game where they need to match the different x-ray images to the technical name of the matching body part. A wonderful way to learn and play at the same time. There are also great activities included, such as this create your own x-ray using black paper and art straws. It's also a fun way to see just how accurate your child can get this. Time is dedicated at the end of every lesson for children to reflect on what they have learned to really help embed this new knowledge. As a way to check this, children can place a tick next to the I can statements on the success criteria grids also found within the packs. In addition, each lesson also comes with a differentiated activity sheet related to the subject. These always go up in difficulty, from one star being for those who may need a little support, to three stars for those who are super confident learners. Packs also contain these fun scientists and inventors challenge cards. Can children rearrange an anagram to name a famous scientist and say what they achieved? Can children match scientists with their achievements? Can your child arrange a list of inventions and discoveries into chronological order? Children will love finding out about the history behind the science of everyday objects. For example, did you know that the first known toothpaste was in fact invented in North Africa by the ancient Egyptians as early as 5000 BC? Children will also have the opportunity to carry out some science investigations, such as this brilliant create your own toothpaste activity using everyday ingredients such as bicarbonate of soda, corn flour and salt. They will then test the toothpaste to see how effective it is at removing stains course with a reminder that it's not to be tested on your own teeth. Children are encouraged to use their scientific inquiry skills to find out more about the world and how it works, which can certainly be achieved by using Twinkle's brilliant resources. No matter your child's interest, there are plenty of scientists and inventors out there to help develop your child's interest in science. After all, your budding scientist could be the world's next inventor. Thanks for watching. I hope you found this video useful. And if you did, why not subscribe over on our Key Stage 2 channel? See you soon!